Hello everyone, my name is Hannah Sweetman and I work as an online nutrition coach. It dawned on me the other day that not everyone will understand or know exactly what online coaching is. So I run an online uh, nutrition business called Hannah Sweetman Nutrition, uh, not only for nutrition based services but also training services um, and also really kind of trying to develop a better lifestyle for that individual because we know that habits and behaviours are crucial to developing a lifestyle that's maintainable long term and therefore once someone achieves their body composition goals they can maintain it in the long term. Uh, when someone wants to sign up, uh, we'll get uh, and scheduled in a consultation call. And what that consultation call is a, a chance for me to uh, get to know that person, to establish a relationship with that person, um, find out exactly what their lifestyle is like, um, you know, do they have a family, what job do they do, how much stress do they have in their life, uh, what kind of are their current behaviour patterns or their habits, um, and then we can together develop a plan that's going to be suitable towards them. Because a lot of my clients uh, live completely different lives. I've got clients that travel the world as part of their job, um, I've got clients that fight crime and work night shifts, and then I've got clients that work a, a nine to five job. Every client is different and that's what makes coaching so exciting is because no one is the same. After we've had our consultation call and we've established a relationship, uh, we've established how much support you may need uh, because we know that adherence and consistency are crucial towards achieving your goals. So some clients may need less support because they um, have already a good kind of routine and habits and behaviours set in their life. Others may need more support in that beginning and as they establish those behaviours and lifestyle changes uh, they can start to move towards kind of bi-weekly coaching um, and that allows them um, more time in between calls so they've got those habits and behaviours uh, down. There's so many different aspects to online coaching as well. It's not just being told you must eat this and you must eat this at this time um, because if I was to basically just send you a meal plan um, and told you only eat this, only eat this at this time, you're not going to learn anything from me and I'm here to educate you in order for you to establish behaviours, establish um, a way of eating and a lifestyle that suits you and your needs because you're then going to be able to maintain that for the rest of your life. When we start coaching, we'll develop uh, a, a way or, or a, a strategy in order to uh, make nutrition work for you. So if you're very new to nutrition, uh, tracking your food intake via MyFitnessPal may seem extremely daunting. However, if you're very much, um, you know kind of what your macros are, you, you have a really good understanding on how to meet those macros, you love uh, numbers that, um, coming at you in order to give you that feedback, then MyFitnessPal is probably going to be a good way for you to um, understand your intake and your uh, protein, carbohydrates and fat requirements and understand if you're hitting your targets each day. Whereas the other side, if you're very new to nutrition, would probably start you off on things such as meal templates. So these aren't meal plans. Meal plans are very structured and they tell you when and exactly how much you must eat. Um, and I don't think that's the best approach for someone, um, especially uh, the way I coach because I really want to educate you, uh, enable for you to achieve things long term. It might work short term, might be like a six week, 12 week fix, but it won't help you in the long run. So meal templates are different meals um, which have balanced kind of macronutrients. So the one thing I find with a lot of clients is they struggle to hit protein and a lot of their meals are very, very high calories without them really realizing. So we talk about different meals and I give you some examples of uh, ways to hit your protein requirements ways to keep calories very much balanced so uh, we look into things to kind of save calories on so um, making sure that your meal has enough protein in order to keep you satiated um, looking to keep you full and make sure that you hit fiber requirements as well um, and just give you some excitement back into meal planning so for example if you made a um, if you brought a pizza out and that was kind of like your normal lifestyle we might look to be like can we get um, involved in making some pizzas at home? Um, give you some different ideas uh, via templates on how to make like a, um, a more calorie friendly pizza. So there, therefore you're still enjoying your food, you still get to enjoy the food that you love, but at the same time you're gonna be moving towards hitting your requirements and therefore hitting your goals. Now I'm gonna give you an example of some of the ways I uh, coach my clients from a nutritional aspect. So the first one is to use MyFitnessPal, um, and this allows you to track your food intake, 
uh, but it also gives you straight away feedback on whether you're hitting your protein requirements per day, uh, whether you're hitting your fats and your carbs, your fiber. Um, and the way I use this with my uh, clients that use MyFitnessPal is I add them as a friend. This way I can uh, keep an eye on whether they're tracking um, day in, day out. Um, I can also see if they're hitting their requirements. Um, and then what I do is get them to feed back to me um, as their weekly averages, what kind of calorie intake they took on a weekly basis. Uh, basis, what their um, different macronutrients, so their protein, carbs and fats, fibers as well, um, what they were on a weekly perspective. Um, and that way we can really analyze how they're getting on and how they're working towards their goals. Another aspect, so someone that's maybe not as advanced um, and not ready to use MyFitnessPal, uh, would be the meal templates, but also um, there's two types. So there's a type that someone doesn't even want to think about having to piece things together at this stage. They're very new to um, nutrition. They just need to start establishing some um, recipe ideas, but also some ways to keep uh, calories um, in check. So there's also this other template that I've created. This is when people move a little bit more and they want a little bit more freedom, but they also want a really good direction. Um, and these are these templates. Uh, they're great for basically being able to um, pick certain food types on the list and straight away have that feedback of how much of that food they require. So I would give you, for example, um, all right, I need you to eat 30 grams of protein uh, for breakfast and then you would look at the protein list and therefore you would be able to work out how much of that type of food you would need in order to hit that requirement. So how does the training aspect work for online coaches? So the training aspect, yes I may not be in the gym with you as your PT, but I'm as close as possible um, I can be there virtually. So. I always encourage my uh, clients to send me videos uh, of a, um, a set or a couple of reps so that I can assess their technique. Um, and you'll see a great example of this here. Straight away, I can give you feedback, um, whether you send it to me with you in the gym, I can give you immediate feedback then, or I give you feedback at um, the end of uh, a week or at our check-in. Um, in order for you to take that uh, technique analysis into your next session. And this can be a few tweaks in order for you to progress in the gym, uh, which is really, really important. So with every uh, client, I highly recommend that they do do uh, do training, whether that be home, so like a home-based workout, uh, and you don't even have, need to have equipment for this. You can do a great workout um, with you know home-based equipment, um, or if you are comfortable in a gym environment and you um, enjoy gym training, then we'll definitely uh, set you up with a program. Both types of program would have uh, progression each week in order to make sure that you are getting towards your personal uh, fitness goals. I also work with uh, sports athletes, so whether you're looking to uh, run a PB in a marathon or a particular triathlon or cycling event, uh, these can all be catered for as well within the training aspect of your plan. Clients also recognize that training and nutrition aren't the only two benefits they get from uh, weekly or bi-weekly coaching. We know that habits and behaviors are so crucial for maintaining and achieving your goal body composition. Uh, this is what's going to establish a lifestyle that's going to work for you. So we never want a short-sighted plan. We always want to look for the long term. We want to be able to establish something and maintain it. So I really try and help with clients with things such as their sleep, their stress levels, how to manage stress, how to manage um, eating, maybe emotional eating um, or eating out of boredom, uh, really thinking about mindful eating. Um, so a lot, you see a lot in these days, uh, people in front of the TV. We work on things in order to really kind of establish a great environment uh, because I believe environment is key to success. Some examples of some of the weekly objectives I would give to someone uh, to help them with their lifestyle uh, behaviors would be to sit, set up a sleep routine, uh, also manage their stress, give them strategies in order if they do find themselves in a stressful uh, situation, how they could manage this without uh, managing their stress through food. Also emotions as well, uh, managing uh, emotional states and managing them uh, without food. Uh, we also look into how to be happier. Uh, happiness is very crucial in order to um, 
be really like fulfilling in life so therefore it's really important that we uh, set ourselves up time in order to do the things that we truly love um, and this can happen through self auditing and making sure that each month we uh, look back on the month we journal uh, we see what made us happy, address it, and make sure we get more of that in our lives. So I do recommend and work with a lot of my clients on making sure that we do self audits each month through our calls in order to make sure that we um, address things that are working well uh, and address things on things that we can improve. I really pride myself on with my coaching is my service and my relationship with my clients. My clients can contact me uh, whenever they need to on WhatsApp. So whether they're in the gym and they have a question or they need me to check their technique, uh, to whether they're having a particular stressful day and they need to talk about it. I'm there for my clients and this is something I really do pride myself on is my service. Um, I hope my clients do agree and uh, I very much am there to support them and help them achieve their goals. Uh, very important for us always to assess in our calls, so whether that be weekly calls or bi-weekly calls, uh, how they feel that uh, things are going um, and also how they feel like they're uh, going with their progress. That way we get feedback and we know that each of us are on the right page moving forward uh, to ensure that they are achieving their goals um, or working towards them at the pace that they require. So hopefully that gives you a great insight into exactly what online coaching is. It's not just basically a nutrition plan, it's not just a training plan, um, or it's not just helping people establish great habits and behaviours. It's everything encompassed. It's creating a lifestyle that's achievable and maintainable that helps you reach your goals and then maintain them once you achieve them. So I currently offer weekly or bi-weekly coaching services 